I know what I did, they say. As if. I was so fucking high from smoking weed. I'm impressed I remembered where the corner shop was. I know what I did. What a joke. It's almost like that's the only fucking English sentence these two Russian goons know. Oh shit. One of their phones is ringing. Finally. Hopefully their boss will be like, This isn't the guy, you morons. Let him go. Man, I'll tell you. Getting kidnapped is quite the buzzkill. I wonder if Rodney will be able to give me another extension on my payment plan for another banky of weed. If I ever make it out of here, speaking of making it out of here, Boris over there looks mad. I couldn't hear what the phone call was about, but clearly it's not good. Hey, comrades, please, if you don't want to tell me what I did, at least tell me who do you think I am? God, they're like two stone walls. Boris and Dimitri, over there, won't tell me anything. Gone, am I racist towards Slavic people? I should give them less stereotypical names. Then again, I wouldn't have to give them names if they spoke to me. How the fuck did this happen? I don't even know any Russian people. Well, except those people rushing around town. What the fuck, brain? Alright, let's focus. Okay. Okay, breathe. <sighs> How the fuck did this happen? Man, these handcuffs are starting to cut into me. And obviously, with my luck, I'll get tetanus from the fucking pipe I'm handcuffed to. Rodney always said, his pine-scented kush is the cure for all ailments. Wait, didn't he say he was seeing some Russian girl? What was her name? Svetlana? <laughs> I have to stop with these names. It was Anna. I remember now. I remember picturing Anna from Tekken. I even made the joke, does she have a sister named Nina? Damn it. I should have said Elsa. Oh well. You live and you learn, I guess. Speaking of living, I'm going to fucking die here. Hey, gentlemen, please. This is a misunderstanding. Oh shit. Dimitri is getting up. What's that in his hand? Oh god, this is it. Is this how it all ends? Open your eyes, shithead. He just put a sock in your mouth. Man, I really thought that was it for me. Wait, why would you kidnap someone? Keep them for what feels like 70 years, but has probably only been like 3 hours, just to shoot them. Billy and Donovan over there must be waiting for something. No. Someone. No. Somewhere. Wait, what? Okay, if I survive this, I have to stop smoking. My brain is next level fried. Fried or not, my brain is all I have to get me out of this. How did this happen? I don't have any shady credits, well except with Rodney. I work in an IT department for accountants, which is almost as boring as being the accountant. Well, unless you include Ben Affleck as an accountant, then accounting is very exciting. Fuck brain. Focus. I don't even place bets on anything. Well, not money anyway. Only with close friends, and we bet amounts of weed on how far we get in the next round of Fortnite. Could it be Rodney? Could he be trying to scare me straight? I mean, fuck, I only own for, like, a handful of weed. No, that can't be it, right? Fuck, my knees are killing me. Let me try and sit cross-legged. That's better for now. Okay, okay. So if it is Rodney, why would he use Russian thugs to kidnap me? Anna? Is she helping him? They are obviously closer than I thought. She did leave him that note on his coffee table with the lips printed on them. At the time I thought it was cheesy. Nope, cross-legged isn't working. Let me straighten my legs. Oh, these handcuffs need to shift lower. Let me try and shake them down. Oh shit, Benedict is saying something to me in Russian. Yes, of course, I'm sorry. Wait, I have a sock in my mouth. So he won't know that's what I'm trying to say. I'm just going to try and look as apologetic. Maybe you won't be so angry. That seems to have calmed him down. Anyway, I use Rodney's 
kindness against him on extending what I owe him for the weed. But it's not like it's hundreds of dollars. Nope, this position hurts my ass. Let's try something else. Oh, Dominic is getting up again. Oh man, he looks really angry. What's, what's he doing? What is that in his hand? Oh shit, he's gonna hit... Ow. Fuck, my head feels like it was hit with a lead pipe. Probably has something to do with the fact that it was. Oh my god, I just realized that note Anna left Rodney had my fucking name on it. Why the fuck was my name on that note? I had fun last night, Jason. Love, Anna. XOXO. It's weird. It was so clear in my head right before I became conscious again. No, it's probably nothing. Just my brain resetting after the Thor-like hammering Derek gave me. Wait, there's that phone again. Benjamin is opening the door. Finally, someone can straighten all of this out. Oh, wow. The new guy is pretty big. He looks calm. I'm sure he'll take this disgusting sock out of my mouth. Good afternoon, my dear Jason. I am sure you know who I am. At least I am sure you should have seen my photo next to mine Anna's bed, no? Or maybe she is too good at love making for you to have noticed. I am her husband, Nikolaj. Boris, Dmitri, take the body to the pig farm, but leave me his hand. Anna will want something to remember him by, no?